Generally speaking, the only paint found in Tiffany's windows is consigned to the flush areas. You can see that that is true in this lovely window, entitled The Reader and dating from 1897. It is based on an 1889 painting called La Lesseuse, or The Reader, which was created by Jules Joseph Lefebvre, a French academic painter. Lefebvre exhibited his painting at the 1889 Paris Salon. Tiffany was exhibiting his own paintings at that very same salon, and it is there that he may have seen and been transfixed by Lefebvre's captivating painting of this young woman. How Tiffany's glass copy of Lefebvre's oil painting came to pass is unknown. However, it was not uncommon for Tiffany's studios during the 1880s and 1890s to create copies of famous paintings. The location of Lefebvre's original painting is unknown, but black and white photographs of the canvas do exist, allowing us to compare the successfulness of Tiffany's translation of Lefebvre's painting into glass. This window reveals the skill of both Tiffany's glass painters as well as Tiffany's glass selectors. Warm, streaky brown glass suggests her chestnut hair lit by sunlight. White, textured glass, called drapery glass, suggests the pin-tucked pleats of her bodice. Deep red drapery glass, with more sculptural folds, give form to her sleeve. How faithfully this costume was depicted may be judged by comparing it with another painting by Lefebvre which pictures perhaps this same young woman wearing this identical costume. Equally successful is the way that the book has been painted with glass. The grain of a soft leather is suggested with a softly streaked glass, and tight rippled glass gives the effect of pages in the volume that the young woman holds. The background of the window, composed of glass that Tiffany called twig glass, and foliage glass suggests a dense thicket of vegetation, as though this woman has sought the refuge of the cool woods on a hot summer's day for a few stolen moments of pleasurable reading. <laughs>